What is up everybody? How is it going? Welcome back to World of Tanks. Today I am going to play with two different tier 10 Soviet Russian heavy tanks with IS-4 and IS-7. Today's episode is going to be about IS-4 versus IS-7 because lately I have received a lot of comments from you guys where you keep asking me which tank is better, is it IS-4 or IS-7 or which tank should I go for, is it IS-4 or IS-7. In my opinion, the answer to this question is super simple, but what is the answer? Let's watch the episode and let's watch a couple of live battles. Let's go! Let's go rush B. Rush B. No stop. And let's get this show on the road with good old IS4 and hello in the chat to Winty17 and uh, Swartz as well, who said idiot. <laughs> maybe, maybe he said idiot to me, who knows. But um, IS-4 in super beautiful matchmaking, this is my favorite matchmaking for tier 10 vehicles, a lot of tier 9s, no tier 8s and 5 tier 10s. Um, but we have, we have uh, two artilleries over here as well. Okay, this guy, super aggressive. He was actually able to spot me. IS-7 is also going to be over here, side scraping, let's see if I can waste his repair kit, maybe, nothing, I think nothing, I think I wasn't able to do anything whatsoever, now that object U6, this hull is perfectly hiding my, I'm trying to uh, get rid of his tracks, but it clearly is not working out at the moment. T-49 is trying to flank us, I think. And he might succeed in that. Come on, save our RT. AMX-13-105, I believe in you. Save our RT, please. I can see that Emil 2 through the bloody houses. T-30. Oh shit. Oh shit. This is not... The tank I would like to spot from there. Oh my god, this guy is wiggling around like crazy. A T30 is using a 120 mil gun. Really good news for me. Really good news for me. I almost messed up the entire battle. I almost messed up the entire battle over here. Going to fix my loader uh, just for faster reload speed and better accuracy t30 thank god this guy is using 120 mil gun because now i think i am able to move up i think so okay come on move forward no 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 did i really miss my chance to take that shot. Yep, seems like it. Ah, fuck that. T54 lightweight. Oh shit, tortoise. The best DPM in this game. The best DPM in this game. Please save me. Please save me. Nice, beautiful tracking. I didn't want to go out uh, in the open versus that tortoise, of course. AMX 13. 90s behind us as well. Weak spot. This guy should be reloading now. Oh my god, we are losing tanks faster than I can count. Beautiful, good kill, good kill team. But we are still losing this battle. But this battle is not over yet. Tortoise took the shot. But never underestimate Tortoise's DPM. 6 to 9. This AMX is over here. Oh! We have a chance to kill that guy. And we did it. We did it. We freaking did it. Mr. V103. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. We are picking up A to 9. All of our heavy tanks, really good work. Krilla 15. 
Sheridan with 6 HP. No, 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 no. You know what? I'm actually going to load in 1 H around. Well, I am loading it in already. Is 2 6 8 able to pick up the kill or not? No! What? He went down. Okay, let's make it count. Back to the AP rounds. Thank you. 260 is going back. This guy is the fastest tank over here. At the moment. And we actually pulled this off, guys. We actually pulled this off. Can you believe it? Say hello to YouTube. Uh, I guess one of the artists uh, is still on the right side. Oh. Well, I have been spotted. 260 has been spotted as well. Now this guy most likely is trying to circle me to death. And was lost in battle. And he suicided. Okay, Tortoise wasn't able to get Arty kill. Well, actually, 260 needed that Arty kill because he had 5 kills, but good job, team. I thought we are going to lose this battle, but we pulled this off. We pulled this off. Awesome. So, second class, yeah, second class, I don't know why, but uh, 15 shots fired, 15 hits. Uh, top by damage done. Nice, not bad, not bad. 1600 bounced, 1000 HP left. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I think at the moment you saw what is good about IS4. This is armor. Mm, so, yeah, and IS4 actually shines in reverse eye scraping. Like, you angle your tank under angle like this, you turn the turret backwards, and you peek around the corner. Uh, like houses. I don't know, rock, something like that. Reverse side scraping on IS-4 actually works quite nicely because of 160 side armor, guys. This tank has 160 side armor. But now, let's jump into the IS-7. Let's go. Uh, tier 8 battle, yeah, this sucks actually. I would like to see tier 9s, like 5 tier 10s, 10 tier 9s, that would be my, my favorite matchmaking for IS-7 especially. But now I can see budget, but I cannot get enough angle. Oh, now I do, and that shot missed. Okay, well, nothing I was able to do about that. But budget goes down, which is really, really good news for us. And I can see caravan. That shot goes into the tracks. Come on, Russia! Seems like I have to shout Russia after every single shot. KVP V2 is going to be in the position as well. Now I think at the moment we do not have anything else spotted, so I have to be careful about that. Come on. Can I see the IS-3? Oh yes I can. And... Oh! Finally, a penetration. I think I'm going to work this corner over here for now. Now, the crew on Caravan has been stunned. And I missed once again. So, his spotting range is a lot weaker now. I do not need to be more aggressive. I don't think so. And tracked. Did he spot me now? Oh, he actually didn't spot me now. Even without being stunned. I don't know. Fuck that guy, really. And uh, now... Let's see. What did Lerve... Oh, nice. One TD just fired. Second TD fired as well, most likely. And I think it is my time to rush in. Nothing else to do over here anymore. Hashtag drive-by. And let's keep moving forward. AC. AMX AC. And now I am behind the enemy lines, keeping all those guys spotted, what not. Boom, let's do some work. Porsche had to reposition as well. 
And this guy is dead. Nice, Arty. I'm actually going to fix artillery just for a little bit faster reload time, so I'm able to take out that caravan. ASAP. Artillery fired. And I should be able to reposition fast enough. Uh, so I am not going to receive yet another shot from Arty. Ooh, I didn't. What? Really? I'm not able to spot at 5120. Okay, D28 is over there. And now this position over here is one of the best positions for IS-7. To rush in. Okay, Krella 15 has been spotted. Or she go over here. Now there is no reason to load in any HG rounds just yet. Okay, this guy was actually aggressive. I thought they have some sniping support, but apparently not. Come on. Nice. Beautiful. That shot goes in. Come on, take out the poor Sheik now. Faster, faster, faster. And he was able to get away. Krilla is lurking around. And he bounced. Nice. He didn't hit my upper plate. I do not know how many shots this guy has left. He might be out of ammunition. And come on! Read. Oh my god, he didn't take any shots on that AMX. God damn it, he went for the AMX kill. And someone else was able to pick up the AMX before, seems like it. I was able to bounce two shots. And yeah, well that is it, but um, it showed. How awesome of a tank IS-7 is in this kind of matchmaking where I can pull ATR 8s. I rushed in, I killed IS-3, I killed that caravan and I made life super hard for the Krilla 15, for Porsche, for AMX 5120. Uh, artillery wasn't able to shoot me anymore. All the enemy tanks had to reposition to deal with me and this is it. I think Krilla 15 actually uh, repositioned from here to here. So, yeah, IS-7, if you can be aggressive, be aggressive, win the flank or push the flank, and um, you are doing a lot more than you actually think, even when you die. Awesome. And 140 was able to get Top Gun. But, guys, let's play one more battle with IS-7, I believe. Let's do that. And here we go again, God damn it! on fire is salient, tier 8 battle with IS-7. But guys, don't you worry, I am going to make this map interesting for you and for myself as well. Uh, let's kill every single guy up on the hill and uh, let's move on from there. How does that sound? I don't know. I am going to be really, really aggressive, as you can already see. And uh, let's move on from there. God damn. Nepa blue, Nepa blue. No penetration, I know that. Come on. Let's rush them down. Let's rush them down. Beautiful people. Beautiful people. M48 pattern. Oh, this guy is going to have one bad, bad day. Revoloris was able to penetrate me and this guy should not be able to see my lower plate anymore. I try to be in the artist shadow as much as I can. Nice, team is following up, team is following up, beautiful and easy, 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 easy guys. This is how you make this map maybe a little bit more interesting. But this guy is trying to rule my a little bit more interesting battle. Alright, okay, scout is going to kill it, nice, and now, what I'm going to do now is, uh, hey, <laughs> hello, geyser, and uh, what I'm going to do now is, um, I'm going to be aggressive, I am going to push up as hard as I can. Now, the biggest problem is Mouse, who is camping in the base, of course, as you can see, but uh, we are controlling a huge majority of this map. Uh, we should have enough snipers to deal with this situation. I think I am going to put one shot. Well, actually, 
I'm going to take out that bloody artillery. Right about now. And let's push up. Okay. And Amorek. Amorek, Amorek, Amorek. I'm going to be loaded, so let's put that shot into the mouse. Let's keep moving forward. I can expect receiving many, many shots in about now. And boop. I didn't want to miss any shots because most likely my team is going to follow up and is going to deal a lot of damage to enemy vehicles. Let's pick up that kill. Mm. Okay. I think I have to back up now. I think I have to do that. I wanted to get behind those bushes, but uh, I think I am going to stay in the hold down position. Let's track that mouse. Of course, this is a mouse and you are not able to track it. 2.5k damage bounced. So let's deal some damage. Mmm, Uda 03, APCR. Oh shit! Oh my god! Good job, AMX 13105. Good job. I didn't have any backup over here. I do not know why my team wasn't pushing up uh, any faster. Because once again, I provided them perfect opportunity to do that. But guys, I think I made this map and this battle a little bit more interesting for you. Uh, I received a little bit too many shots at the end, but um, GG. 13, 15, hopefully 15 to 2 victory on this map is always nice. Uh, so this was my episode for you today with IS7 versus IS4. Question that I keep and keep receiving from you guys. After IS7's buff, IS7 is a lot better all-around vehicle. There is no question about that. Mobility, armor in hull down position is godlike. Yes, IS4 is uh, kind of uh, IS4's armor is kind of troll armor, but uh, still IS7 a lot better all around vehicle. So if you are thinking about going one of those vehicles, my pick would be IS7 one hundred percent. But guys, 4000 combined damage done in under 4 minutes. Yes, I wasn't able to get too much spotting off because I wasn't able to get behind those bushes where I wanted to go and my team didn't follow up with me, but uh, no biggie. They had to deal with me, my team was able to pick up on some other targets and uh, we won the battle in under 4 minutes. Because I used, in this kind of matchmaking, I used my tank what it is made for. So, this was my episode for you today, IS7 versus IS4. I hope you enjoyed today's episode and I catch you in my next video, which is most likely going to be up tomorrow. Stay awesome, take care and bye Reno.